Where do you go when you want the latest in alternative comics and zines? Well, here in Hollywood, it's Meltdown. Another place is Toronto, where we talk to the guys at Comic Jam, a gathering of indie comic and zine enthusiasts. Hi, I'm Rupert Bottenberg, and I organize the Comic Jams. If you look around here, you can see it's divided into two parts. Upstairs, I've got rock bands playing right now, and I've got uh, other weirdness. I've got a magician playing, uh, doing, doing tricks tonight. Uh, and then down here, we've got a room full of cartoonists who are doing strictly collaborative comic strips. That is, they will, uh, someone will take a page, draw a panel, and then pass it along to someone else. This isn't the best place maybe to do collaborative work because it is a little confusing, but this, this stuff is more fun. Doing collaborative work is really important and interesting. It's nice to get together with people, and, and it's, yeah, sometimes it's easier that way because you can bounce things off people and stuff. Well, for starters, cartoonists. That's my uh, most reliable sort of draw is uh, amateur, semi-pro, and even a few talented professional cartoonists, uh, almost all of whom fall into the category of alternative or fringe cartoonists. It's really that sort of thing. My name's Jay Stevens, and I do a couple of comics, one called uh, Land of Nod for Black Eye Productions, and one called Atomic City Tales for Kitchen Sink. And um, I love these comics jams. I'm, I'm basically here because a lot of my friends are here. And most of us cartoonists work out of our studios all by ourselves most of the time. And don't really get to interact a lot with uh, our peers and with some of the people that, that read what we do. So that's what these things are great for. I love the collaboration, actually. It's, it's actually really refreshing to see how somebody else interprets where you're going with something. I, I think you, you can learn a lot, actually. If you're doing this kind of stuff. There have been other people that sort of use similar ideas, but strictly what I'm doing here is pretty unique. But I don't really want that to, to continue. I'd like to see other people pick up on the idea. I don't want to have to keep doing this for the rest of my life. I'd like other people to pick up on the idea and do it in their own community. I'd like to see every city have a common gem.